my name is Todd Fields, and today we will be testing three different types of golf balls for our freshman engineering class. The general sense is, is that the more expensive the ball, the better it is. So we have our top of the line ball, Titleist, our middle ball, Callaway, and our cheapest ball, Spalding. So today we're going to test to see if that is true, that the more expensive one is better than the rest. To do that, we'll be testing three attributes. First being roll. This is either how it rolls while hunting or rolls just generally after being hit. Second is balance. This is either being how it bounces after being hit or after landing. And lastly, being aerodynamics. This is how it performs in the air, whether it gets checked by the wind or not, or just how far it goes. To test the roll of the ball, we had the ball roll down a PVC pipe and then onto carpet. And we measured the distance from the end of the pipe to where the ball stopped at. For the bounce test, we dropped the ball from a given height and then recorded the height of the ball after the first bounce. For the aerodynamics test, we launched the ball from a catapult and then recorded the distance that the ball traveled. Each test was performed multiple times to ensure accuracy. After the data was analyzed, we determined that the best golf ball for its ability to roll is Titleist, the best golf ball for its ability to bounce is Spalding's Top Flight, and the best golf ball for its aerodynamics is Titleist. Because every golf course is different and some golf balls are better than others in different environments, we divided the best overall golf ball into two sections, long game and short game. In a long game course, the distance between the tee off area and the flag is large and thus a golf ball that travels farther is best suited for this environment. In first place is Titleist, coming up in second is Callaway, and in last place is Spalding's Top Flight. In a short game course, the distance between the tee off area and the flag is much shorter. However, these courses typically make up for the lack of distance with difficult terrain, narrow fairways, and steeper slopes on the green. A ball that's more consistent and has better control is best suited for this environment. Taking first place is Titleist yet again. In second is Spalding's Top Flight, and falling into last place is Callaway.